Hello and welcome to Doctor's Orders here at the Chrissy B Show. I'm Dr. Rob Hicks. Today I'd like to talk with you about depression. This is an incredibly common illness that will affect around about one in ten of us at some point in our lives. Now depression isn't just a case of feeling a little bit fed up or a little bit down in the dumps for a day or so. With depression a person feels very very sad, very low in their mood for, for weeks, months, sometimes even years. Depression makes doing everyday things much harder than it should be. So for example, you may only have to get up in the morning, make breakfast, get dressed and go to work. But for somebody with depression, just doing that can feel like they're having to climb a mountain or, or run a marathon. There are lots of symptoms that people suffer when they have depression. So feeling low, feeling sad, and not getting pleasure from the things that they would normally get a lot of pleasure and enjoyment from. These are key symptoms for those with depression. People's concentration usually isn't as good as it should be. Their performance isn't as good as it should be. And they find themselves becoming very irritated, being irritable. They get angry for no reason, they fly off the handle. Or they break down in tears for, for no apparent reason as well. Some people find that their sleep is disrupted, so they have difficulty getting off to sleep at night. Or they wake in the middle of the night and then can't get back to sleep very easily. Or they find that they wake up earlier in the morning than they actually do normally. And some people's appetite is affected. Some people will lose their appetite, but others will find that their appetite is increased and they'll eat lots and lots of, of food and they tend to, to gain weight. Some people find that they're very anxious they feel very, very stressed and they can't quite pinpoint why. Now thankfully, depression can be successfully treated. It's, it's not a case of just pulling your socks up, just pulling yourself together. That doesn't work. For people with mild to moderate depression, exercise is a wonderful treatment and can help them beat this illness. Exercise helps release the feel-good hormones, the endorphins that lifts a person's spirits, that boosts their mood makes them feel in a better frame of mind to tackle depression. We of course have counselling and psychotherapy which are very effective ways of helping somebody to overcome depression and we have antidepressant medication as well and most people will need a combination of different treatments to help them deal with their depression. What's very important to remember is that there's, there's no guilt or shame associated with depression and it's not something that you've done wrong. We believe that depression is an illness caused by an imbalance in brain chemicals and actually there's, there's not a sign of weakness, it's not a failure. Depression can be treated, depression can be beaten and you can overcome depression. So make sure that if you're feeling that you may be depressed or that you've got somebody that you, that you love or are close to that may be depressed, then do please, please seek the help and advice from your doctor. And that's Doctor's Orders.